Hi, welcome to Inspire Gallery. Um, I'm so proud to present the work of Lean and Alice and have a wonderful guest speaker who is our uh, renowned art layer upon each other and it's fascinating for me. I want to uh, work that way, that's why I work with layers and lines and marks which layer upon each other and uh, sometimes they are all uh, covered over. Some of them get pulled through, some of them get on top, but even underneath they still have life and they breathe and they that's, that's the history. Each painting uh, builds up its own history. Obsession. Obs 
Din, ser du tilbake til jobben? Ta. Din, tell me what artists have influenced your work. Tony O'Malley, Green Cozy, Paddy Graham. Din, tell me, how long have you been painting for? I've been painting since I was a kid. A small boy. How happy are you to have an exhibition of your work in the Inspire Gallery? I'm quite happy, yeah. How would you describe your paintings, Min? Um, abstract, they're looking down on the landscape. They're really abstract landscapes. These are from memory I paint. The paint from straight to the camera here out of my studio. In my landscape in Mexico, where I live. And the hot place that I'm, where I come from. Yeah, I should be looking down from above. A colour in your painting. I can express my feelings through colour. And you like strong colours? I do. speaker who is renowned Irish poet Rachel. He enjoy Anna's amazing heartscapes because they are a tonic for the heart. So Anna asked me to read one of my own poems for the opening night, something that would speak of ideas of landscape and heartscape. So here goes. Five packs overthinking. We didn't pay much heed to play those jet streams the toing and throwing at Dublin Airport. Dad taught us to keep nicks, watch birds for their covert flight paths on warm shafts of seasonal wind and late daylight over fingers. The cuckoo, heron's bird, announced each late spring. Swifts scudded, courted above the tallest root ivy summer. Corn crakes in Darcy's backfield, screamed and secreted autumn. Out at Dolly Mount, the Brent East, wingspan and ivory wintertime. The finches rise and fall, their mad hard flap, all that flap for a long, easy glide. We learned the most from the home place first. Our feathered banner, the ravens, how they mastered gravity vectors. Omnivore feeding, prey dodging, and cloud top scaling. They could sense a shift in a skyscape, or how a thundery rainstorm may bias the pure DNA map back to the hatchling, nestling fledgling grounds, our raven always returning to that magnetic place. We heard wing beats 
gaze for a flock of raisins, something soaring over our estate out beyond the So, ladies and gentlemen, two very gifted artists, Anna and Lee, remind us of the art of place and the place of art. Liam O'Rourke's landscape, his eco place where we can live, is a birth of land. And Anna Renovich, <laughs> Renovich, her escapes of the hiding places where the spirit made it. Thanks very much and enjoy the opening.